Yo, what's up, sexy Sam underscore today? We're here doing a ranked 1v1. As you can see, uh, I'm playing Anubis. I have 130 ping because I'm uploading a video as we speak. It's 79%. Um, I'm uploading a video. Do you mind if I pause to... Okay, well, never mind because it didn't go through. Never mind. Minions have spawned. Let's see, man. On her is a really, really bad matchup for Anubis. We'll see if we can do anything about it, though. With 130 ping, could be pretty tough. Okay, he was fine. Just press beads. Okay, I am lagging my mind out. I actually have 150 ping now. I canceled that one maybe 30 seconds earlier than that. I don't know. He gets a red buff now. My message didn't go through. Oof. Big, big oof, dude. All right. Well, that's dope. I mean, it's not the coolest thing ever because we still lost first blood, but at the very least, we stopped him from having red. And we got a kill back, so. Not awful. I would love it if my video would be finished uploading, though. That would just. Oh, man, that would be fantastic. Give me more. Hmm. How long is Beats cooldown? 160 and Aegis is 180. We pretty much used our relics at the same time, so... Uh... He can probably just kill me, though. You know, now that I think about it. Not to mention, like, how am I gonna hit stuff? When I have no cooldowns. Or not cooldowns, but when I have no when I have no ping. That did not look like it was gonna hit on my screen, but okay man, appreciate it. Dead to archers, yes. Yes. And my video is done uploading. Look at that ping go down, boys. Look at that ping go down. That's how you do it. We lived through the... If we lived through the laggy days, we thrive during the 40 ping days. I do a lot of damage. I mean, he does have Transcendence, though, so he will do, like, a significant amount more damage than the amount of damage that I thought I did. Ow. Ow. Okay, on her. Relax. Give me more. Um, Red's not up, right? So, we're good. We could probably kill him. Wow. Okay, the auto impale combo did half my health. Then I Aegis the alt and then he jumped and I just immediately died. He had beads, right? So like if I landed the wrap, I was probably fucking oh, dead okay. anyways. Uh, 
Oh, that's really, really, really bad, man. The fact that I didn't get his beats there is awful. I knew he was playing that corner too, dude. I knew it. Nobody backs when Red is spawning. Especially when you're the one with pressure. That was so stupid. I literally walked into his fucking trap. I should have just let him have Red. That would have been the smart play. That would have been what a real player would have done. I'm gonna go breastplate. He's gonna have a pretty gigantic lead on me for a while. Not really much I can do about it. The bull demon, really? Alright. Doesn't have lifesteal. Like, yeah, he can alt me, but he doesn't have beads, so if I land a wrap, he dies. A monument to my opulence. Oh, yeah. I don't know what that was. He didn't have beads, so I knew if I landed a wrap, he was dead as hell. The FG play was... Okay, but it was just that. It was okay at best. Like Enter my dimension. He did have pressure on me, but not enough for a bull demon play, in my opinion. I mean clearly he thought something different, but I don't know. Go back. Grab this. We'll sell that so I can defend that tower. Do you think I am weak? Starting up his defense. Your middle tower is under attack. A monument to my opulence. Witness my cosmic power. Roar. Oh, no doubt. I'm a bad mother. Oh, you I did actually cancel. Um, well, that's annoying. Enter my dimension. I did actually cancel my alt because I thought, I figured as a sitting duck there, it would have just been terrible had I decided to stay and hold that. for me to back yet. Uh, honestly don't know what to get. I'm just gonna go shell and hope that whenever I upgrade it, it will actually stop some damage for me. Bracer's not very smart, right? Because I already have lifesteal and I'm Anubis. This is a good play to take my blue there. Let's get his beads. I used my shell because he used his beads and his thorns, so it's worth it for me. He's trying really hard to like poke me. I think that's a pretty decent sized misplay. That was a really good back for me. 
Did some decent damage on the tower. Don't overstay my welcome, though. All right, he's coming back. I'm backing. I can grab this. Did he just alt, by the way? Did I just hear an alt go off? I don't know. He has no cooldowns up. If I did this video, I'll go off. But for his sake, I really hope I didn't because this is gonna hurt him if I did. Yep. I knew exactly where he was jumping. I basically, like, I held my three. Because if I placed my 3 down there, he would have jumped. And if I didn't place my 3 down there, I would win the auto attack fight. So I knew that he would be forced to run away. There's no way he could outplay me there in any sense in order to win. Um, win that fight, that is. So the only thing I had to do, realistically, was sit there and wait for him to mess up. And he did. I mean, he jumped and as soon as I saw him go up in the air and the direction he was looking... I knew exactly where to place my three. That's all I had to watch. Enter my dimension. Grab that so he can't. Witness my cosmic power. Um, I will have my alt up again. Maybe I can snatch something on him. There's a storm. You can push him out pretty heavy here. I mean, that actually helps me. Him blocking minions helps me a lot. It means that my minions will actually hit the Phoenix because I can clear. So he actually helps me get so much more damage on Phoenix here than I would have been able to. Hit him a couple times there. Oh, he's going double D. Gonna need a shard. Those beats. His blue is up. That's not good. A monument to my opulence. That's not good for him at all. <laughs> that is really not good for him. I'll pick this up and then do Bull Demon. And uh, that should be a Phoenix. I was actually gonna build the Divine Ruin uh, with this item. But, I mean, looking at his build, I don't need it at all. I guess I was just so used to people building, uh, build Embracer and Duel. So yeah, I'm just gonna grab that and then I'm gonna get Obsidian. Cause he's going double defense, so I'll go double pen. I'm actually gonna sell my Obsidian, or not my Obsidian, I'm gonna keep my Obsidian. I'm gonna sell my Spear of the Magus for maybe an Ethereal, depending on how much health he has. That was just a fucking sick ability, right? Enter my dimension. Oh, I'm just awful, aren't I? to jump away. I don't know if that was the play. Uh, he stayed to clear minions so that I couldn't take tower. But uh, if he's dead, I can take the tower with any amount of minions. So it was a good play. If he got the minion wave and he lived, or like if he got the minion wave all together, like even these two archers, it would have been an alright play because I probably could not have taken the Phoenix. 
But the fact that he didn't get all the minions just kind of demolishes that play. Oh man. Get the slow on that and then I'll assault him. Okay. Well, that was an alt for an alt. Uh, works out for me because I'm the one with the pressure. And actually, I'm going to stay because I'm the one with the pressure. And I'm not scared of him right now. I definitely walked into that, and that was the big fucking stupid. Poke Titan with my three whenever I get a chance like that. That did a lot of damage. Okay. I'm gonna run away because he'll kill me and I'll feel like a big dumb. Or will he kill me? Yeah, he's dead. Oh, he's not dead. All right, GG. We were able to beat Hatmaster in the on her versus Anubis game. I I messed up a lot early game, but I got it together later. And um, he just put a really defensive heavy build against my really pen uh, build. So yeah, I mean that just that's how it worked out. Make sure to check out my merch in the link below. Um. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I upload a video. Check out my Twitch channel on twitch.tv. And until next time, guys, peace.